I'm going to show you how to use Microsoft Access to create database, to create tables, to insert data in it. So as you open it, you, of course, you'll see blank desktop database. Click, then create here uh, in your NA name. Solver, create. Then by default, you see a table here will be created. Then we're going to name our table by going to view, design, view then put the name for example i can say school say okay Over here we can have maybe student number student number and this will be our primary key okay then it is going to be a mixture of letters and numbers so it will be short text then it's going to be our primary key Okay. Then we can have another field, for example, name. And then, of course, name will be short text. We can have another field, address. Then, address is long text. Then we can also have another field, amount. Then, amount is going to be in currency since it's money. Uh, monetary value okay so look for currents here and then maybe lastly let's have date of birth date of birth date of birth of course will be date and time select date and time date and time like that now we can now view our data sheet by going to view say yes as you can see okay so we can sample, for example, H001, this is our primary key, and then the name we can have maybe Herbert, maybe Solver, the address can say Ginger, amount, can enter amount, can enter any amount. Then date of birth, date of birth, you of course you must just select automatically. Click, can select any date of birth. Then can sample another Our number zero two. Then we, we, another person you can have Flavia. Okay, let's have the order Flavia coming from maybe. Uh, uh, Iganga. Then amount you can enter amount. Date of birth select. Then another person. Let's have another person. Okay. Then from there, what you can also do. I'm going to show you how to how to create forms. So to create a form. To enter more data. Okay. Go to. Uh, first close this this okay because if you open here you'll see it first close then go to create go to form uh, form design as you can see here okay then go to property sheet or if you don't see property sheet you can click f4 then you select record source this is my table and then go to uh, add existing fields what you do you drag drop drag and drop drag them drop drag drop okay I think perfect if, if you don't understand you come in my comment section okay now from here you organize your, your fields then maybe uh, else what else you can add button for button you come here this XX I think click on it click on bottom then to the pop up you say record operations then add so for add is like to clear our first button then next then text 
next finish do the same to for save click once click at the bottom record operations save record next text next finish now we are going to run our form and see the view and then how we enter of course when, when you look here we are going to enter a, a drag number of h004 here observe so try to observe so go back to the form here to go back to the form come here right click then go to go to go to form view so this is how our form looks like now for us to run click add so observe when you click add all what's in the text here they're going to disappear away see see i think you can see okay so you can enter new field h00 so here i told you here we're having h003 so you can now enter h004 go back h h004 name can enter any name for example uh, rahuma okay and then uh, wakiso then amount you can enter amount can enter amount maybe this date of birth just select beautiful select now let's we're going to save and see so save don't fear calculating finished so we go back and see if it has gone come back here refresh we see if the new value will come here refresh you can see wow 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 good 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 this is very good so also another step i'm going to show you how to add a query I'm going to only select guys with letter f f only to to display okay so as we wind up how do you make such a query go to create go to query design okay then from there as you can see here this field so the field name will be here on top then sort you can sort them all after i'll show you okay so the table name is here you can select then say add okay then after that close then click here it will come here the field go to the next click go to the next address click then amount finally date of birth then you can see that all of them they can show okay then where do you write the command so you can come to criteria under name you write f steric f steric so i told you that we're going to select only guys with letter f here the names now go to run uh, go back come to query again then right click then say data sheet view can see okay okay like that so thank you for watching my tutorial we we'll meet in the next coming videos